12 is from the golf. And that's going to push some of these forms, moving them toward the east, where they interact with the Atlantic Sea breeze and really flare up across the east coast this evening. And then the activity settles down a little bit. But with all the moisture in place, you, in, in type of this pattern too, you get a shower storm at just about any time during the day and during the evening and during the night. Tomorrow, similar pattern in place, a southwest wind flow during the afternoon, pushing those storms back off toward the east. So today, temperatures peaking into lower 90s. It's humid after the shower and storms go by. Those temperatures will cool back down to the 80s. But as you know, sometimes those storms make it feel a bit more humid after the storms pass by, too. Tonight into the 70s for showers and storms. And then tomorrow, like today, back to the lower 90s with partly sunny skies. Another round of weather storms. Big weather story is not too far away. We have a stalled out front just to our north over parts of the deep south. And we have storms along that flash flooding. Doesn't take much rain to cause that across Louisiana and the Mississippi. We'll be watching that here for today. And then across the northern tier, the heat's building there. Billings, Bismarck, into the triple digits. But we are expecting temperatures staying warm there. But after big time heat in the southwest, moving forward with cooler weather now arriving in parts of Arizona. More on our forecast coming up in a bit, but first, by Star 9. <laughs> story is brought to you by Bernetti PA. Auto accidents, medical malpractice, or injuries at work? 1-800-BERNETTI. We're ready. By using the Spectrum Mobile Savings Calculator, you can easily see how you can save hundreds of dollars a year by switching to Spectrum. I don't use calculators. Oh, this one's easy. You just put in your current provider, how many lines you have, how much data you use, and see your savings instantly. Wait, you've never used a calculator? Yeah, I put it all in my head. Okay, what's 865,329 and 64? 652,458,000. Is that right? 